Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am going to be doing the ColourPop Tinkerbell Collection makeup unboxing. I got it in the mail yesterday and I did put the makeup on for this video. Um, a lot of my videos I've done, I'm not wearing the product, but I did put the product on today. Um, so let's just dive right on in and talk about what I got and my thoughts on the product. So here is the collection. The packaging is so, so pretty. Let's just go ahead and start off with the palette. Let's pop her out. Now, like I said, I have used it, so these aren't new pans, so don't be alarmed. But, let's see. Here we go. But it's not helping, is it? Here we go. So that is what they look like. Um, there are one, two, three, four mats, and the rest are um, shimmer. Yeah, the rest are shimmer. Now, this gold shade right here, I did use that on the center of my eyelid. Um, it's called Small Fairy. I did find that that had a lot of fallout. Let me get a makeup wipe ready, and I will do a couple of swatches um, just for you to see what a few of these look like. So I will go ahead and swatch Small Fairy. So the, these are really, really pigmented, 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 pigmented. Why does it sound so weird I'm saying this? Why am I saying it weird? Pigmented. There we go. Got to say it fast. And let's do this pretty green. And then let's do this one right here. So as you can see, all of the shades are really, really pretty. Um, that lime green is probably one of my favorites out of it. And I really didn't use um, it much. I did kind of go underneath my eye with it a little bit. But I did use um, Small Fairy. Uh, Big Magic, Sleep, and Tink. So I used quite a few of these shades. Um, in my corners here, I did use one of the Super Shocks that I'll show you in just a minute. So yeah, these. this is the eyeshadow palette. Very, very pretty. Um, ouch, pinched my finger. So let's move right along. Let me wipe this off and get prepared. Um, let's go ahead and pull out the, um, Super Shock eyeshadows. Comes in this little package. You pull it out. It is a, uh, triple set, a trio. Let me pull those out. This is the color that I have on my inner corners. Let me swatch it for you. It does not take much for these really really pigmented creamy they do blend well they go on really smooth let me go ahead and do this one um the green is the shade straight on till morning this one will be fly to your heart and the last one is never grow up my philosophy or no mine's never grow old mm. so that's what they look like all of them just glide so easy they're all really really pretty um i really want to work with these pinks and they're well it's like a purpley kind of color i really want to play with them and create another look with those um, cause I, I do really like this collection. It's super pretty. All right. Next come with one of each of the super shock cheek. Now this is my thoughts on this. So one is, well, I can't get it out cause I didn't put it up right. One is a really, um, dark, 
peachy kind of color. It's, it looks like a bronzer color. And then you've got this um, really light highlighter color. And then you have the super pretty um, pinky, um, lighter, peachy kind of color. So what I did was instead of saying, okay, well, this is a blush, this is a blush, let me choose. I kind of used this one as a bronzer, this one as a uh, blusher, and then I used this one as a highlighter. Um, I'm not really sure I liked that one as a bronzer. It's probably not meant for that, so I probably won't do it again and see how it turns out. But it did blend out. I just, I'm not 100% on it yet. I don't know. Maybe once I wear it and see, how, I don't know. I don't know. I might grow on it. I just wasn't 100% sure about it. So let me close these bad boys up. I'm just making a huge mess in front of me because I'm not really putting anything away for the sake of time. Then you have, and this is cute because they are two creme gel eyeliners and the packaging does line up. I don't know if that was intentional because, I mean, her face is all the way around, but I thought it was cute how that happens. So I will swatch these. I did only use uh, one of them. This is in Lost Girl. This is not the one I used. This is like a coppery brown. It is really pretty. Let me swatch it for you. That's what that looks like. It is pretty. But I went ahead, since I was doing some greens, I went ahead and used this one. Um, this one is in the shade Fly With Me. And that one is what that one. I did do my lower waterline and went in a little bit on the crease. And then I went back in under on my lower lash line with um, that lighter eyeshadow shade sleep right here all right and then the last two items in the collection are both lip products um let's see this is the one i have on this is called tinkerbell it is really pretty really pretty this is a glossy lip stain to me, it does not um, dry glossy, so it just goes on like a gloss, and then it dry, it dries like um, somewhat matte, but not that drying kind of matte feel. feel. It feels great. I have not ate or drank anything yet, so I'm not sure how well it'll stay on, um, but I'll update my comments in the description and let you guys know. But yeah, so this is it, and that is what is on my lips, so I'm not going to swatch it because you can see how it looks. But then the second one, and this is still a glossy lip stain, this is in the shade Clap If You Believe, and there is the applicator. So the applicators come, and they're kind of like, I guess the applicator's are pink and then they put them in um, because that's how my other one was too. So here is a swatch of this one. Now this one has more of a brown undertone to it. And then that one is that. Clap if you believe. So Tinkerbell and Clap if you believe. So that is it guys. Let me know what you think about the products if you have them. Um, I'm going to keep fiddling around with them and change up the look. See, you know, what I can create out of it. I do want to use some of the pinks and purples in there. Um, I do like the greens, but maybe I just want to try the pinks and purples. Naturally, since it's Tinkerbell, I gravitated towards the greens. Um, nothing real fancy. I'm going to lunch with my husband, my son, and we're meeting a couple of friends. So I didn't get too out of the box with it, but this is what I did. I don't know how you're supposed to look to show it off. But anyhow, I want to say thanks for stopping by. If you have not subscribed, what are you waiting for? Hit the subscribe button. 
press the notification bell, get all the notifications for future uploads. And as always, thank you and love you. God bless. Bye-bye.